Hello and welcome to the PMOD introductory series. In the next few minutes we will provide a short overview of the PMOD pixelwise kinetic modeling tool. The quantitative potential of functional images from PET or SPECT can only be exploited with sophisticated data analysis approaches. PMOD's general kinetic modeling tool analyzes average signals from predefined tissue volumes resulting in tabulated data ready for statistical analysis. The pixel-wise kinetic modeling tool PXMOD offers a complementary approach, applying the models directly to the signals from individual pixels. This creates quantitative maps of individual variables, as shown in the example to the right. The beauty of this approach is the visualization of the spatial parameter distribution and its further use for statistical comparisons. PMOD's pixel-wise modeling tool is the leading workflow-oriented solution for quantitative parametric mapping. More than 25 configurations are available, including blood-based models, reference tissue models, and linearized models. The user is guided through all of the tasks involved in a step-by-step -step fashion. Once the parametric maps are calculated, PXMOD offers versatile tools for inspection of the results. For later reproduction and adjustment of data processing, the complete configuration of a processing session can be saved in a protocol file. The following three minute demo will give you a brief impression of the pixelwise kinetic modeling tool. A dynamic PET dataset of DASB uptake will be analyzed, resulting in a serotonin transporter binding potential map. The map is first calculated using the simplified reference tissue model, then with a composite model. The selection of the simplified reference tissue model 2 is the first processing step. From this point on, the step-by-step -step PXMOD workflow will be driven by the red action buttons in the lower right and run through a series of dedicated pages. On the first page, the dynamic DASB study is loaded, after which we proceed to the next page for definition of a background mask. This mask will remove activity outside the brain from the analysis. The next step is the definition of specific tissue regions for seeding of the model. In our example, the cerebellum VOI serves to define the reference signal and the striatum a representative target tissue signal. The corresponding time activity curves are calculated and visualized on the next page. They will be used to calculate prior information for the pixel-wise calculation. In our example, K2 prime. The calculation of this prior information is configured, followed by curve fitting and inspection of the result. In the event of a good fit outcome, the calculated priors can be applied for the parametric mapping. At this stage in the process, the parameters of interest for the mapping are configured. In our example, the BPND parameter is the main outcome and it is restricted to values between 0 and 10. Finally, the simplified reference tissue model with fixed K2 prime is applied in each pixel. The resulting BPND map is shown on the next page. It represents the distribution of the serotonin transporter in a quantitative manner. There are many different approaches for the calculation of BPND maps. Using PXMOD, they can readily be applied simultaneously in a composite model. The resulting BPND maps can be visualized in parallel and can be numerically compared, for instance, by calculating the difference map. This ends our short introduction to the PMOD pixelwise modeling tool. Trial installations are available to test the full functionality of PMOD and its tools. Please visit our website for more details and for information about the other products from PMOD Technologies. Thank you for your attention.